Hello, I'm Annabelle. Hello there, my name's Rob and we work at Confection Perfection. Today we're going to show you a range of ideas on how to bake and decorate cakes. This is how to make a 30th birthday cake by Confection Perfection. A very popular choice for 30th birthdays is to choose the numbers, the three and the zero. So I've baked my cakes in the number tins. I've chosen to ice mine in sugar paste, but you could use whatever frosting or icing you prefer. You could use chocolate ganache, you could use a buttercream. And that's then your blank canvas that you can decorate how you like. You could choose something quite general, or you could personalise it to the recipient. I've chosen a red and white colour scheme, which is very striking and would suit either a man or a lady. To enhance it further, what I've done is shell piping around the top and the bottom. This is done using red royal icing with a number 44 piping nozzle. And by piping around the top and the bottom of the cake, it's adding detail, it's adding colour, but it's also accentuating the fact that this is a three and a zero. To neaten the design and add some more colour, I've chosen to put a ribbon around the cake board, that's fixed on with double sided tape. The easiest way to fix a ribbon around the side of the cake is using a little bit of royal icing. What I'm going to do is just dot the icing around at regular intervals. And then you want to secure the ribbon, making sure that it's straight and level the whole way round. At the back, you want to just put an extra little bit of icing to hold the ribbon in place. You can then add a cake bow. You could look at the video, How to Tie a Cake Bow, and fix this on with a bit of double-sided tape and you can just press that on at the front of each cake. The decoration possibilities are endless. If you wanted a fairly general theme, you could opt for a champagne bucket with balloons, which you can arrange on each cake mixing up the sizes and the colours, like that. You could add some stars. All of these have been made out of icing. Stars are quite a fun decoration. They add a little bit of height. They add some colour. If you wanted something that was a bit more personal to the recipient, perhaps they're into music and they enjoy guitar. So you could put a handmade guitar, We've got music notes that we've cut out of icing here. And you can see how by sticking with the colour scheme, you've got something very striking. It's going to be eye-catching. If it's a large party, that would be a real centrepiece. You could add a little figurine of the guitar player to add to the effect. If, however, your recipient was more into football and less into music, you could add caricature football player and some cut out football decorations which you could either sit flat or you could stick into the cake at an angle to add some extra height like that. If you wanted something more feminine you could add a spray of flowers again sticking with the colour scheme. You might prefer something more contemporary such as shoes and handbags. Shoes and handbags, again, link the colour scheme through and it's actually something really quite fun to put on the cake. You might prefer something that's just pretty. Butterflies are a very popular choice. And you could team that with a selection of just little cut out flowers, like that. If you're having a large party, you might want something with a bit of extra height. So we've got a burst here. And so these shapes, they've been cut from icing, threaded onto wires and let dry, and we've then painted them. You can spread the shapes out, and you can then stick that into the cake, which adds height and a bit of impact. 
This is particularly suitable if it's going to be a large party and you could always add a star or something in front to hide where that's gone into the cake. So that's how to make a 30th birthday cake by Confection Perfection.